Islam means peace acquired by submitting our will to Almighty God. And anyone who submits his will to Almighty God, he is called as a Muslim. Islam is there since time immemorial, since man set foot on this earth. And Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, is not the founder of this religion, but he is the last and final messenger of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, of Almighty God. This is asked the question, that what is my advice to those Muslims who fight among themselves, like in Syria, like Shia, Sunni, what's your advice? Point number one, Islam does not believe in sects. Allah says in the Quran in Surah Imran, chapter 3, verse 103, Hold to the rope of Allah strongly and be not divided. The rope of Allah is the glorious Quran and the authentic hadith of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa Allah says in the Quran in Surah Anam, chapter 6, verse 159, that, O Prophet, if anyone makes sects in the religion of Islam, you have nothing to do with him. So making sects in Islam is prohibited. Quran letters. al agaf verse 9. Is Islam is the teaching of Allah. Was it a prophet, former friends, Madjab cleric, Hadith cleric? Whether he became a Salafi, Muhammadiyah, Shia, etc. It is impossible to return to the Quran and Hadith. Must memorize the Quran, master Arabic, memorize millions of Hadiths. Religion with the Quran and authentic Hadith, explained by experts. Fiqh by Madjab cleric. Hadith by Imam Bukhari and Imam Muslim. Almighty means not weak. Not everything. Weak equals dead, human, androgynous, seen, etc. If you don't believe in God and the supernatural or unseen, try to prove it, how is a piece of wood, become a ship by itself or because of the explosion. Quran. Al-Hajj verse 78, Ali Imran verses 19, 52, 67, 84 and verse 103 equals call yourself a Muslim and don't belong to a class or sect. Groups are permissible. The happiness of people not care of religion, usury, sin, stinginess, arrogance, etc. Only until God takes the life, by Hermazel.